More celebrations as they continue throughout eastern Idaho today to remember and honor those who have served our country. Local News 8 Seth Ratliff has the details on local veterans celebrating and bringing attention to a national issue. Seth, what is that? Well, that's right, Todd. I'm still a little choked up from that last story, but another Veterans Day celebration took place at the Idaho Falls Elks Lodge today with an important purpose. The Elks have been serving and helping veterans since at least 1917, and this year they're providing assistance to local former service men and women who are experiencing homelessness. The Elks National Foundation has provided grants for our local lodge, which is providing backpacks and other resources to help veterans overcome this complex issue. We've been awarded several grants so that we could purchase the backpacks and all the supplies inside. And we're hoping to distribute those to as many homeless and needy veterans as we can today. We're trying to set up a network where they can call us, come here, and we could direct them the right direction for assistance and help. According to Mission Roll Call, the number of homeless veterans is increasing with over 35,574 ex-military members experiencing homelessness throughout the country. In Idaho alone, the United States Department of Housing and Urban Development reported 149 homeless veterans in 2022. That number may seem small, but to organizations like the Idaho Falls Elks Lodge, even one national hero experiencing homelessness is one too many. Veterans with the Elks Lodge have asked us to remind you and the veterans in the community that there are several resources available to help veterans facing hardship in East Idaho. We have a link to those resources on our website, localnews8.com. In the studio, Seth Ratliff, Local News 8. All right.